Hi everyone, this is another little video uh, tutorial I guess about Digital Performer, Motu Digital Performer and using the commands window. This is a uh, important little trick that I guess I've kind of come up with for myself in particular to move from marker to marker in the timeline um, because you may want to jump to another section of a song uh, I kind of developed this in particular to do with live performance because I wanted to have multiple click tracks and backing tracks in Motu Digital Performer and want to be able to jump from song to song very, very quickly. Um, this, But this can be really helpful if you're recording, uh, you just want to jump from section to section quite quickly um, from marker to marker and begin playback and record. Um, so the way I've done this is to set up keystrokes to jump from marker to marker using the commands window. So you simply click on setup here, then click on command or commands. And in this instance, I just typed in marker and you'll see a few here, go to next marker and go to previous marker. And all I did was find a keystroke that worked for me. Now, a key, the keystrokes that I use, it's we've got the, the period dot and the comma here. Um, the, the main reason I set up using these keys to jump to next mark or go to next marker and go to previous marker is because they're actually the arrow keys as well. Um, and that to me just symbolized on the keyboard what it meant to jump forward and to jump backwards. So clicking on the next marker, I put in the keystroke uh, period dot which is the right arrow and for go to previous marker I just pressed comma which is also go to the pre go to the previous marker or the, the left arrow um, another one I did was to go to I think it was rewind and because that this the forward slash key is next to the arrows I set that as my rewind and rewind simply takes you to the very start of of your timeline if you like or your sequence so I, I use those keys to quickly get around DP and navigate um, moving around DP quickly from section to section and being able to um, jump from for either song to song if I had lots of uh, backing tracks in digital performer or if I'm recording just to be able to jump from section to section that I've marked um, quickly so I can move around um, quite effectively in DP for recording. Another little keystroke that I've set up in the commands key is to do with the mixing board because often you would have a track selected in your tracks window and then jump to the mixing board and there's only one track. Now you could click on this little box in the corner here and quickly select all the tracks and all of a sudden they'll all appear in your mix window. But Often what happens, I thought I'd be great just to have a, a keystroke, just to do this simply. So, for instance, if I jump to my mixing board and only one track appears, I've assigned the key Y to simply bring up all the tracks at once, which I find really, really helpful. So the way to do that again is just to go to Setup, go to Commands, Window. You can, there's lots of different customization you can do here for lots of different um, events that you may want to have. but I just wanted to look up show all tracks and I just typed in a key that wasn't being used which is just the Y key and uh, assign that. You could even have multiple keys or keys set up to do multiple things. DP can handle that um, quite easily uh, even if you just wanted to use a particular keystroke that's being used for something else. Um, DP can cope with that. So. As I said, jump to the mixing board. Now I click Y and all my it shows all my tracks at once. Just another little tip or tips for using and customizing DP that I find really, really helpful, particularly jumping from marker to marker in a song. Hope that helps you. Enjoy DP. Thanks for watching. Please click like or subscribe to my channel and share if you like. Thank you. Take care.